season 11 of The Walking Dead has been building towards a brutal and bloody finale over the past few weeks. With viewers' favorite characters in jeopardy and more at stake than ever, can the heroes save Judith, played by Kaylee Fleming, defeat the Horde and put a stop to the Commonwealth once and for all? There's just a few days before the final episode airs on AMC, and showrunner Angela Kang has teased what fans can expect. Showrunner Angela has promised a show first for The Walking Dead's season finale which will highlight the massive scale of the flagship's last episode. Although plenty of spin-offs are currently in the works, including returns for Rick Grimes, Andrew Lincoln, and Daryl Dixon, Norman Reedus, this will be the last time all the core survivors will be sharing the screen. To help establish the epic scope of the production, the series brought in a full orchestra to supply the score. This marks the first and last time the series was able to do so, so episode 24, Rest in Peace, is guaranteed to feel extra special. So it's really going to sound exceptionally cinematic, Angela said. The score that Bear McCreary and Sam Ewing came up with is so beautiful. I hope that it's released as a soundtrack unto itself, because it's pretty incredible work. The series is already well known for its bombastic and eerie soundtrack, not to mention its iconic opening theme which has remained the same for the past 11 seasons. Hopefully, fans will soon be able to hear the score for the final season in isolation as well as a backing track to the apocalyptic drama's last battle. As for what fans can expect to see in The Walking Dead's conclusion, Angela is keeping details close to her chest but has provided a warning for viewers who have kept up over the years. It's a highly emotional episode, she told TV Line. It's a ride. For the audience, there will be tears, and the tears will come for different reasons for different characters. Insight, teaser, news, the show's fans are already concerned beloved young survivor Judy could be killed off after she was shot by Pamela Milton, Layla Robbins. Although some characters will return for their own spin-offs, there's also the likes of Eugene, Josh McDermott, Gabriel, Seth Gilliam, Carol, Melissa McBride, and Rosita, Christian Serratos, to consider heading into the finale. While no one is truly safe, either from the Commonwealth or the zombie invasion, Angela has also assured fans there will be plenty of opportunities to spend time with their favorite characters. But we really felt that at the core of this, there's horror in this world, she continued. There's obviously action and adventure. But the reason people follow these people is because there is heart, there is a chosen family, there's something about their will to make it past the worst circumstances that is inspiring. So we leaned really hard in that direction, because we felt that's what the core of the show is. There are really lovely character moments between people, she added. I'm so blown away by our cast and the work that they put into it. Greg Nicotero pulled out all the stops directing a very, very challenging, huge episode in the midst of all the things that we had to deal with production-wise. The Walking Dead concludes Sunday, November 20th on AMC in the USA and the following Monday on Disney+.